had a very interesting situation happen to me a few minutes ago, so I decided to share it with you and then ask you a question. So, I was going through the bathroom and I'm cleaning this section of the bathroom and there was this plate. You know those little plates that you sometimes have in the bathroom where you put all the knickknacks that you really don't know where to put anywhere else so you could have that? Well, okay, I dusted it. Then I decided to take it to the kitchen to wash it. And I went ahead and I washed it. But there were some plates on the sink and I decided to wash those also. And the next thing you know, I came back to the room without the plate, which was the whole point of living the room in the first place. Now, there are two possibilities for this. One of them is ADHD. For those of you who don't know, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder is a chronic condition including attention difficulty, hyperactivity, and impulsiveness. ADHD often begins in childhood and can persist into adulthood. It may contribute to low self-esteem, troubled relationships, and difficulty at school or work. Symptoms include limited attention and hyperactivity. Treatments include medication and talk therapy. That was thanks to the Mayo Clinic. So then, the other choice would be brain fog. And while it's not a medical term, brain fog describes a feeling that you don't have full mental clarity. Maybe you're having trouble remembering something or difficulty focusing on a thought or idea. And that is courtesy of HackensackMeridianHealth.org. So here's the thing, if you've been following for a little while, then you know that I live with two th separate conditions. One of them is IBS and the other one is gluten intolerance. Now, gluten intolerance has some symptoms that mirror fibromyalgia and all those three diseases have one thing in common and it's called brain fog. However, as far as personality disorders or mental health issues, I have had ADHD since I have use of memory. I don't know if you remember, there was a movie for Disney called Up, and there was a scene where the dog can talk because this guy created a collar so the dogs could talk. And every time they were talking to the guy, all of a sudden, I mean to the dog, somebody would say something and the next thing you know, the dog would go squirrel and the attention span was gone yeah that's me so i'm gonna leave it for you because i cannot wait to see what the comments are gonna be on this one but do you think that little snafu i just had was brain fog or do you think it was my adhd acting up thanks for watching bye